Would I be the asshole if I took my son and his friends out for his birthday instead of my wife and stepdaughters? I am 42 have three kids. A son Isaac 12 almost 13 with my ex who is no longer in the picture and twin stepdaughters from my wife's previous relationship Emma and Ava. Isaac's 13th birthday is coming up next week, and he said that he wants to go to the movies, and asked if he could bring two friends along. I agreed, and we planned a day out of fun arcade, pizza, and a movie. These were all activities that I know that my son and his friends nerdy middle school boys would enjoy. When I told my wife about our plans, she suggested that we should have a family outing instead, and proposed a local kiddie play place that my stepdaughters apparently love. I said that Isaac and his friends would be very disappointed, and that he wouldn't have fun at the kiddie play place. She tried to convince me that Isaac could still have fun because there was an arcade two claw machines, a pinball table, and a small DDR machine. She also said that, since he sees his friends at school every day, family time should be prioritized over friends. I told her that it was unfair to force Isaac to spend his birthday at a kiddie play place instead of with his friends. She accused me of favoritism and of not loving my stepdaughters as much Isaac. This hit me pretty hard because I grew up with a stepfather who neglected me in favor of his own kids, and I've been trying my hardest to be the father figure I never had. I've been spiraling down a rabbit hole of doubt about my own choices, and for the sake of my own sanity, would I be the arsehole? Not the arsehole a play place is not somewhere a 13 year old lad wants to take his friends for his birthday. It's his birthday, not the daughter's. As much as I understand the wanting to do family things, you can do that on another day. Not the asshole your wife is showing favoritism to her daughters. This is Isaac's birthday celebration, not Emma and Eva's. And does she know about your issues with your step-parent? Because if she does, then she's a bigger asshole for using it against you. Not the asshole or kiddie play place that appeals to seven-year-olds is not a suitable birthday choice for a newly minted teenager. Suggest to your wife that if she wants a family birthday party in addition to, not instead of, his outing with friends she needs to think of something age-appropriate to be appealing to a 13-year-old, and which the younger kids may also like. But for his birthday celebrations, his interests need to be prioritized. And when it is the younger children's birthdays, tell her you'll expect him to be polite about a family outing that caters to their age group. Not the asshole, but shouldn't you be concerned that your wife is neglecting your son in favor of her own kids? It seems like she is accusing you of doing what she is actually doing by trying to force Isaac into the kiddie play place for his birthday. Is this a pattern for her? Nta? Ironically, if you did go along with your wife's idea, you would be showing favoritism to your stepdaughters over your son. Stand your ground, your wife is emotionally manipulating you. Not the asshole. It's your son's birthday. The point is to do what he wants. You were right with you said. It's not about what your stepdaughters want in this moment. They can do all of that when it's their birthday. Say I would never ask the girls to spend their b-day doing something Isaac wanted to do and you should show the same respect. Also, she's gaslighting the fuck out of you. And I'm betting it's not the first time. Why doesn't she take the seven-year-olds to the play place while you are with 13 yo and his friends? There is likely no universe where a 13 yo boy wants to whoop it up with seven yo baby sisters on his birthday. How would wife feel if you made the girls do son's current plans from their birthday? Or in your wife's birthday? Not the asshole. What you're doing is not being the stepdad who neglects his bio kid to cater to the step kids. So your wife wanted your 13 year old son and his friends to spend his birthday in some kiddie play area because her daughters would like it better? Then has the cheek to accuse you of favoritism? There's only one a hole here, and it ain't you. You'll be making a huge mistake if you do as your wife wants because you'll be letting your son down badly. Please don't be that father. Not the asshole, but your wife sure is. 
not the asshole and her tactics to guilt you into it by saying you don't love them as much as manipulative as Helen she's the are in all this. Your son is asking for these things for his birthday and she wants to do something completely different to make the other two happy, and then blames you for having favoritism? On the other dad always put my stepsisters first. When I was 13 I had to have this lame party at an arcade because my little stepsisters would find it more fun. I wanted to hang with my friends and see the coolest movie ever made. Dad chose them again. Your choice. Um no. Not the asshole. Isaac's birthday, Isaac's choice. On his 13th birthday it's absolutely reasonable for him to want to spend the day with his friends doing teen friendly activities. Plan a family dinner and cake or something to celebrate together, but his birthday does not need to specifically accommodate his younger siblings preferences. That's what their birthday is for. Your wife is way ye off base. Not the asshole. She is manipulating your feelings, if she knows about how you felt growing up. You need to firmly tell her that it is your son's birthday so it is his choice on how he celebrates not hers. You can plan a second family party after but he is old enough to decide what he wants to do on his birthday and who he wants to spend it with. She is attempting to show favoritism by not understanding what her stepson wants. Not the asshole. Tell her that they can have their birthday at the kiddie place. The only way you will show favoritism is if you force your kid to do something specifically for his step-siblings in his birthday. She's showing clear favoritism, you are just celebrating the birthday boy. Sounds like she's gaslighting you, and I don't use that phrase lightly. Absolutely not the asshole this is Isaac's birthday. His special day. Isaac is allowed to celebrate it how he sees fit. There's really no need to try and make every kid happy when one kid has a birthday. As long as birthday kid is happy. Wife is being ridiculous. Nata, but your wife is. Birthdays come but once a year. It should be your son's day. She wants to do a family day out. That's a great idea and you should do it, any day except your son's birthday. That she brought up he sees his friends at. He sees her in his siblings every day too. Stick with your plans. Not the asshole. A 13th birthday party at a kiddie play place? Without said 13 years friends present? Nope. Ask her if she'll be letting Isaac choose what to do for the twins 8th birthday. If she wants a family fun day, then you should all organize a family fun day. Some other time. At a venue that is equally fun for everybody. Let Isaac celebrate his 13th the way he wants to celebrate his 13th. Not the asshole. Your wife is a huge asshole though. She's the one showing favoritism and then trying to make you doubt your choice. Huge red flag here. Why does your wife have a problem with you spending time alone with your son and letting him do what he wants for his birthday? This is what you should be asking yourself. Your wife has an issue with your son. Not the asshole, but you would be the ass of you allow her to make his birthday about her and her kids. P.S. Your wife is shady AF trying to manipulate you by playing on your insecurities to get her way. Talk about favoritism, this is all about her kids. She is the R. Stick to your plans, have the guy outing. Tell her she is more than welcome to take the girls out for a girls day at that time. Take a step back and really look. Talk to your son about the family things you do, is he happy with them? How long have you been married to her? Here is the big question sorry but who is the breadwinner in the family? I have seen to May post like this that the woman that is all about her kids moved way up the financial ladder and became a stay at home mother when she got married. Absolutely not the asshole. Keep sticking up for your son. It's his birthday and he should get a say in what he gets to do. The arcade, pizza and movie with his friends sounds perfect. If his stepsisters aren't interested in that, they should stay home. Natai don't even know what to say like it's your son's birthday and you want him to enjoy his day. Why is the wife acting like it's her stepdaughter's birthday when it's not and that they deserve more attention like what? 
not the asshole your wife should go to the kiddie place separately with her own children while you go to the movies and arcade with your son. If she gets defensive, my money is she wanted to treat her children to a day of fun on your dime at the expense of your son. Nope. You are completely right in this one. And she needs to back off. Not the asshole. The day is about Isaac, not his stepsisters. They can have literally any other day of the year, but by prioritizing them over him on his one special day, that tells him his birthday ranks below the joy of two kids currently about half his age. Ask your wife how she would feel if she was forced to do something that put priority on somebody else having fun over what she wants to do on her birthday ask her to be in Isaac's shoes. Not the asshole, she's manipulating you. It's your son's birthday, he should be able to do what he wants. What 13 year old would want to spend their birthday at a kid play place? When it's time for the girl's birthdays. Is she going to cater it to what your son would want? She's abusing your insecurity. Not the asshole it's your son's birthday, not your stepdaughter's so there's absolutely no reason why you should do what they want instead. Big red flags your wife expects you to cater to her daughters on your son's special day. And the whole favoritism thing? It's his birthday, of course you're gonna favor him and do what he wants. You if you listen to your wife.